Coaches, it is time. Boy, am I excited about this one. There is so much uh, excitement going around today. Kind of a big deal. Um, Energized Fruit Punch just launched. I'm sure you guys got yours, which is great. Um, Transform 20 Group wrapping up this week. We've talked about Morning Meltdown 100. And guys, we are here to talk about, right here, look at this, Ultimate Portion Fix. Hey guys, this has been so fun to learn about, so fun to understand. And the more I understand about it, the better and more convinced I am that coaches, you need this to help not only yourself, but the coaches that and the people that you are talking to. And that's why we're so excited to bring on Autumn, guys. She is here. She is going to be live um, to talk about this. Um, but remember, this is March 4th. This goes live for you coaches. There she is. Uh, Autumn, welcome to our call. It's great to have you. Hello. Thank you for having me on this morning. Happy to be here with all you guys. Yes, we're excited to have you. Okay, so I'm going to kind of keep my mouth shut. I'm going to let Autumn go. But guys, remember, take notes. Um, write down the dates. Write down what some of the talking points that she mentions because obviously she's a creator. She knows the, the best about this. And she understands not only these, but the reasons behind it. And it's the why that matters. And that's what she's going to talk about. Autumn, I'm just going to turn the time over to you. Take it away. All right. Thank you. What's up, you guys? Happy Tuesday. Hope everybody is having a really great day. So as, uh, as he mentioned, we are going to be talking about the upcoming launch of Ultimate Portion Fix. And there is a lot to cover. So what I want to go over with you guys is the Ultimate Portion Fix home program, what you can expect from that the Ultimate Portion Fix Master Coach Certification, the ongoing Master Series, and then the upcoming um, refilming of 21 Day Fix and 21 Day Fix Extreme in real time. So there's a lot to cover. We're going to be on together for about 45 minutes, but like I said, a lot of valuable information coming your way. So let's just start with Ultimate Portion Fix, the home program. I think the biggest question I'm being asked is why Ultimate Portion Fix? Why now the containers? have been around for the last five years. So what's the point? What are we learning now? What are we getting now that we haven't already gotten in 21 Day Fix or Fix Extreme or 80 Day Obsession or any one of the other programs? And here's what I wanna say. If, if 21 Day Fix was the 100 foot dive into nutrition, then Ultimate Portion Fix is the 1000 foot dive into this program and the how and the why behind how it all works. So with 21 Day Fix, when 21 Day Fix came out five years ago, you got your DVDs and you got your guidebook and you got your containers. And it was basically like, here's your formula for 21 Day Fix and here's your food lists and you pick some foods off of it and you fill your containers and you're good to go. You're going to lose weight and feel great and be successful. And that does work. Obviously, we've seen that work for the last five years for hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people. But for hundreds of thousands of more people and probably millions more, they need a little bit deeper why behind it. They need a reason and an understanding of how this all works. So with 21 Day Fix, it was a little bit of like the monkey say, monkey do, like me just telling you, fill your containers, it's portion control, and you're good to go. And you basically have to like trust me from there about all the science behind it, and you don't really have a deeper understanding. So with Ultimate Portion Fix, we're really going in for this deeper understanding of how it all works. With the program, with the home program, I believe there's 36 different videos, okay? So you're going to get 36 different videos. There's six modules, and I just want to touch briefly on what each module is about so you have an idea of what you're learning. So module one is the introduction to Ultimate Portion Fix and the, the sort of the basic science and principles behind how the container system works. There are three principles behind Ultimate Portion Fix. There always have been. No, I'm not going to tell you what they are. That's the whole point of you getting the program and learning about it. But these three principles are how and why the container system works. And we've only ever touched on one of them. We've really only ever talked about portion control. So there, I just gave you one of the three. Um, so I'm going into what the other two, um, what the other two principles are behind the container system. And what I want to tell you guys is this. I don't believe that there is one way of eating that works for everybody. There's hundreds of nutritional theories and that, that, work for people, work for people at different points in their life, okay? But there are these three main principles that when practiced and practiced together, I do believe they can and will work for everybody, for 
almost everybody. Um, and, and so we're going into that in module one. We're going to look at food addiction and sugar addiction. And we're going to really, really look at food addiction and sugar addiction because this is a big deal. This is a huge reason why we're having the obesity epidemic that we're having, why people will lose weight for a little bit of time when they're on a diet, but end up gaining it back. Um, this is where the frustration lies when people think they're making healthy choices. They're doing their best. They're putting their best effort forward to eat properly. And they don't recognize that there's all these hidden sugars in their food. And there's these health claims on the packages that are telling them it's good for you. And really, you know, you, you turn the side panel over and there's more sugar in the healthy product than would be in a bowl of ice cream or something like that. And we're going to talk about why you might go the whole day doing really well, sticking to your plan, only to end up in the pantry or in the fridge at nine or 10 o'clock at night, binging on the junk food. We're going to talk about it and figure out why that's happening and how we can stop that from happening. We have to go deeper. We can't just scratch the surface on nutrition and think that we're going to make an impact. And so that's what we're doing with Ultimate Portion Fix. We really are going deeper into all of this. Uh, we're also going to talk about finding your deeper reason why. Why are you doing this program? Why now? And getting that really strong understanding of it. And that might not seem like a very big deal, but it is. You can't just say, Oh, I want to lose weight. So I look great in a bathing suit. You know, summer's here, spring's here, summer's around the corner. So I want to lose 20 pounds. So I look good in my bathing suit. That's great. Okay. That's a goal, but that's not your deep reason why we have to get into it and really get to the root because there are going to be hard days. There's going to be days when life kicks you when you're down and you just want to give it. You just want to go have cocktails with your friends, a lot of cocktails, or you just want to binge eat on the junk food, the comfort food. And you're going to need that deep reason why to stop you in your tracks from doing that, to stop using food for emotions, to deal with emotions. So we are also taking on emotional eating with Ultimate Portion Fix. Because again, if we don't beat this, if we don't beat food and sugar addiction, and we don't beat emotional eating and learn how to stop doing that, we will forever yo-yo up and down, roller coaster ride on this crazy diet system. We don't want to diet. We just want to learn to eat to fuel our bodies. Okay. So that's module one. And then in module two, we're going to talk about the three different paths that you can follow while doing ultimate portion fix. And there's three different paths. They're based on where you're at already in your health and your wellness journey and what your goals are. And again, no, I'm not going to tell you what the three paths are right now. That's the whole point of getting the program. But we'll talk about these three paths in detail and how to use each one um, and for how long you might need to use each one based on what your goals are. We're also going to talk about different nutritional theories that you can use the container system with. I obviously get asked a lot about um, paleo, intermittent fasting, the keto diet right now. So I address all of those things in module two. I also talk about being vegan or vegetarian on the ultimate portion fix. We've had the vegan plan out for four years now, but I've never really in one place sat down and gone in depth about the vegan plan. I've never really explained to you guys, how is it similar to the regular plan? How is it different than the regular plan? Um, what do the food lists look like? And things like that. So, so I'll talk about being vegan and vegetarian on the plan as well. And then we're going to get into module three and module three is like the meat and potatoes of how to use the container system. So for a lot of people, module three might feel like some repeat information that you've heard a lot in the past. But let me just say this, it's always good to get a refresher course. There's always things that we forget. But also, in addition to that, there is new information in there and more in-depth information. So in module three, we're going to talk about the different formulas you can use. Um, based on what your goals are and based on your activity level. So are you, are you not working out? There's a formula for that. Are you doing moderate intensity activity? There's a formula that, for that. Are you doing high intensity activity? There's a formula for that. The beauty with how we've done Ultimate Portion Fix now is that in the past, the container system has always been paired up with a Beachbody program. Obviously, one of mine or in the last several years, we've, we've put the containers with all of the new fitness programs. 
But now you're going to have the ability to help people that aren't even doing a beach body program. There's a lot of people out there that like to participate in different forms of activity than what we offer, right? They don't necessarily want to do an in-home workout. Maybe, maybe they're a marathon runner or a triathlete or, you know, some people do CrossFit or whatever it might be. And so we've never been able to bring them necessarily into our community because they're like, well, you guys are at home workout programs and that's not what I do. Now you can still help those people. You can still work with them. You can be like, great, cool, do your fitness thing. How about I help you with your nutrition for better performance for that goal? You have a whole new group of people that you're going to be able to reach because it's not paired up automatically with a fitness program or even people that just aren't ready to exercise or maybe they have an injury so they can't, but they're looking to get their nutrition on point going to be able to help that many more people. So learning the different formulas, learning when to use them, why to use them, and how to use them is going to be important. And we're talking about that in module three. We're going to take a deep dive into both of the food lists, both the food list for the regular plan as well as the vegan plan. We're going to talk about how the food lists work, a little refresher course there for some people. We're going to talk about how they're different, how on the regular plan you might see some things on the yellow list, but on the vegan plan you would see them on the red list. Uh, we're going to talk about freebies and substitutions. So again, when 21 Day Fix first came out, you got your little book and it had the food lists. And in the back of the book, there was like five or six recipes. And there was like one little page of free or of substitutions. And everything was automatically uh, classified as a yellow. Anything that was sort of deemed junk food or like not something you have all the time was automatically classified as a yellow. And while that worked back then, we've come a very long way in the last five years with two cookbooks and a new cooking or a cooking show and over 300 recipes. And I wanted this to be a significantly more accurate representation of substitutions. So like if you're having chocolate covered almonds, chocolate covered almonds used to just be classified as a yellow but that wasn't entirely accurate because it's still almond. You got to account for a blue. So now it's a blue and half of a yellow, depending on how many you're eating um, or a full yellow, depending on how many you're eating. So, so going into the substitutions, reminding people how often they can have them, how you have substitutions where it still fits into your plan and it doesn't hurt your results or your progress uh, so that you don't have to feel deprived. We're talking about wine and beer and hard alcohol and what all of those count as, um, different spices and seasonings and marinades as freebies. So we're getting in depth um, a lot in module three about just like the crux of how the program works. Now, here's what I want to explain to you guys. I know in the beach body world, we think everybody already knows all about the container system. And we're shocked to hear if somebody doesn't. But as the creator, I can tell you, there are plenty of people out there who have never heard of any of my programs. They've never heard of the container system. They have no idea what it's all about. Okay. And you're going to get to work with those people. And that's fantastic. They need to go through modules one through three before starting to try to implement the container system because they need a really good understanding of what it's all about and how it all works. If they try to jump right in on day one without learning, you know, the principles behind it and, and learning about food addiction and sugar addiction and learning the formula that they should be using and the food lists and how the food lists work and the hierarchy and all that, if they don't learn that, it's going to feel really overwhelming and they might not stick with it. So anybody that's brand new to the container system definitely needs to go through modules one through three before they start the program. And then if they choose to start following it and using their containers after module three, it's also really important to remind them and encourage them that there are still three more modules to go that has a ton of pertinent information. So they need to keep watching and learning even though they're already using the containers. OK, so after module three, we get into module four in module four. We are going to take on the grocery store. So we're going to talk about maneuvering the grocery store, both the perimeter and the aisles, because while for a lot of people, the grocery store is just great. You go in, you get your fruit, you get your veggies, you get your protein, you get your things. For a lot of people, the grocery store can just be like, again, overwhelming. And what do I do in here? And when you start to realize how all these foods have all these hidden sugars. It's like, well, what do you might panic and get stopped dead in your tracks and be like, well, what, 
what do I get when I get here? Or how should I handle this? How should I take it on? So I'm just walking you guys through the grocery store, explaining what you're looking for, what you're trying to avoid, um, all those things that you need to know when you go grocery shopping before you start your meal planning and your meal prepping. And then in module four, we're also talking about meal planning and meal prepping. And what I mean by meal planning is how do you lay out your day? How do you mix and match your containers so that you have really well balanced meals at every meal and you don't end up at the end of the day with just a blue and an orange container left for dinner because we all know that doesn't make a meal. And that would really be more, more like meal planning for beginners. And then we're also talking about meal planning for more advanced people. So for people who maybe use the containers for a while and want to use the fixate recipes, if you're going to have enchiladas for dinner, the fixate enchiladas for dinner, they're like, it accounts for like six of the containers and some of them are half containers and that sort of thing. And so you need to pay attention to that and make sure you save those exact containers for dinner. And the only way to do that is to plan and then work backwards from there so that you understand how to do it and you you don't get left with the wrong containers. So it's just me really explaining that in detail. And then we're also talking about meal prepping. And meal prepping is a big one. I tell you guys all the time that being prepared isn't half the battle, it is the battle. It really is. If you're not prepared, you're not gonna be successful with this. But meal prepping can feel very overwhelming to some people. They go on Instagram and they see these accounts like meal prep masters and whatever else there is and there's all these photos of all of the person's meals laid out for the entire day and for the entire week. And it's just like, oh my gosh, people look at that and they're like, well, I can't do that. I don't have time for that. I don't want to do that. That's for them over there. So this must not be for me if I have to do that. And that's not the case because we all know you can meal prep in so many different ways. So just talking about that, explaining that, showing how you can meal prep in different ways. That's module four. And then we get into module five. Module five is so important and it's so much fun because we've never talked about any of the information ever in module five. This is family fix. We're talking about using the containers with our kids. So for the first time ever, I have containerized them to work for the kids. I do want to say this. The, the formula for our kids, this is not a diet or a weight loss formula for kids. This is healthy eating to fuel their growing bodies, okay? That is very important to keep in mind. If, if somebody feels their child needs to lose weight, then they should talk to their child's pediatrician or a registered dietitian or nutritionist and find out what that specialist feels, um, how many calories that specialist feels their child should be eating. And then they can bring that information back to the plan and find where their child falls on the plan and then go ahead with it. But again, it's not a weight loss formula for kids. And the way it works is it's broken down into three categories. So um, you'll figure out your child's formula based on if they're male or female, their age range, and their activity level. And it's all super easy, but very well laid out and defined for you so that there's no guesswork there. We're also talking a lot about how to use the containers for different age groups in module five, because how you use them with a five-year-old is going to be very different than how you use them with a 15-year-old. So I'm going through all of that. And then one of the most important videos in the entire program is in module five. And I actually think whether you have kids or not, this video is so important for everybody. It's called Food for Thought, the Psychology of Food. And in that video, I'm really taking on the emotional eating and talking about um, how, how you interact with your food. Because a lot of times, the way we interact with our food is, is what we learned growing up. So it's what we learned from our parents, and we might not even realize it. So like, were your parents the ones who always rewarded you with a treat when something went well, or comforted you with a treat? when you were having a bad day? Or was your parent always on a diet, jumping from one, uh, one diet trend to the next? That's, that's all stuff that we subconsciously, we observe it, we take it in subconsciously, and then it plays out with us as an adult. So bringing that up to the surface, bringing that to the forefront of your mind and being aware of it and acknowledging it and starting to ask yourself the questions of like, well, what do I do? How do I interact with food? Because again, if we don't take this on, if we don't conquer this, if we don't change the way we interact with food, we're never going to beat this problem. 
So um, that, that's food for thought, the psychology of food. It obviously goes much deeper than that in the video, but I'll leave that for you guys to watch. And then the last module is module six and it's special ways for special days. So I get asked all the time, well, Autumn, how do I go out to eat if I'm on the container system or I have to go, I'm going on vacation, so I guess I can't stay on it. I'll do it when I get back or, um, you know, the holidays are here. So how do I stay on point? So it's me breaking down all of that for you in each video about how to handle the holidays, how to travel using the container system, how to go out. You guys, I followed this for years and years and years. So I promise you can do all of those things and stay on point. You need to know how, and you have to be willing to do the work. Um, but that's what we're taking on in module six. There's also a couple of bonus videos. There's a video all about all of the Beachbody supplements, performance lines, Shakeology, the Beach Bars, Daily Sunshine, and how those um, work with the container system. There is a specific video on pregnancy as well as breastfeeding so that, um, Moms can use the program as well, as long as they've been cleared by their doctor to do so. There is a break in case of emergency video. This one is really important because at some point somebody's going to get stuck and they're going to feel like they're not making progress and they're going to wonder why. And they can turn to this video and it's me just walking you through all the different checkpoints to make sure you are doing certain things and that you're not doing other things and what you can do to correct that so that, um, so that you continue to have results. OK, so that's all the videos in addition to the home with the home program, with all the videos, you're also going to get the ultimate portion fix workbook. And this workbook is designed for you to use as you go through the videos. So for every video, there's a chapter in the workbook. There's a summary of what that video is about. If there is a worksheet that I'm talking about, it's in the workbook. So you can do it right there as well. There's a place for you to take notes. So the workbook's going to be really important for you to use as you go through the videos, okay? Then there is also the Ultimate Portion Fix Daily Logbook. And the logbook is meant for you to use once you start implementing what you're learning. So Ultimate Portion Fix kind of has two start dates. It has the start date of when you start watching your videos, using your workbook, and learning how the program works. And then the second start date is when you actually start using your containers and implementing what you're learning. And the daily logbook, it's going to allow for you to track everything from um, your meals for the day, your Shakeology, your water intake, um, your workouts, if you are working out. But there's some other things in here that are really important that maybe you wouldn't necessarily expect to see in a nutrition program. We're tracking in the morning, what's your daily goal for the day? That's up to you to decide. We're looking at, um, we're rating your sleep, your mood your energy when you first get up in the morning. All very important things to tell you how your body is responding to all of this. And then at night we have, um, we have reflections where we're gonna take stock in what your, how your attitude, you're gonna rate your attitude about your body for the day, about your nutrition, about your energy. We're gonna look at what went really well for the day. What did you maybe struggle with that still needs a little work and improvement? Was there something you learned today that you wanted to remember? These things are all really important because while everybody wants to think that weight loss is just calories in versus calories out, right? Eat less, exercise more, burn more calories, and you'll lose weight. That's like the old way of thinking. It's not accurate. There's so much more that goes into it that we have to pay attention to to make sure we get the results and that have the progress that we want. Sleep is key. Sleep is when your body repairs. It's when you uh, restore your energy, re replenish your energy. If you're not getting a good amount of sleep and restful sleep, your body is going to be stressed out. It's going to release more of the stress hormone cortisol. You're going to wake up tired looking for energy, which means your sugar cravings will probably be stronger because your body's looking for a readily available energy source. And sugar is that. How many times do you not get a good night's sleep? And like, that's when you want the like super sugary coffee. Today at three or four o'clock in the afternoon, you're at the vending machine buying junk food, chocolate and things like that because your body is looking for that energy. Whereas if you just get a good night's sleep, you can avoid all of that. We have to look at, um, are you hydrated? Because your body is more than 70% water. So if you're not hydrated properly, your cells won't function and repair and work at optimum levels. So looking at if you're hydrated, 
Also, if you're not hydrated, things might not move through you like they should be. So we got to talk about going to the bathroom. We have to look at bowel movements. Are you going every day or not? Because if you're not, your body's holding waste. And if your body's holding waste, that's more weight in your body, which means that scale isn't going to move. So we have to check in on all of these things. And that's what you're going to be doing with your daily log book. Okay, so with the home program, you're gonna get all of the videos, you're gonna get the workbook, you're gonna get the daily log book, you're gonna get the new cookbook, Fix 8 Volume 2, 102 new recipes. Um, yes, there's paleo, yes, there's vegan, yes, there's vegetarian, um, there's ADM session recipes in there, although they're not marked, but there are plenty in there that work with um, time nutrition as well. So you'll get that. You're also going to get um, the ebook that I had created or the PDF, I guess that it is. It's 75 healthy lunch ideas for kids. I had created that two years ago on my own, but have since passed it off to Beachbody to go hand in hand with this program. Now that we have containerized the program for kids, I wanted to make that available to everybody as well. Because we all know that packing lunches, if you're a parent, is like the bane of your existence, right? Like it's just like the most miserable thing in the world to have to come up with lunch ideas every single day. Uh, so this is 75 uh, healthy lunch ideas. Honestly, your kids are going to love them. I did it for Dominic. That's, that's what sort of sparked it. So these are meals that I know like he'll really enjoy and I won't get a lunchbox home coming home full of food. Um, so there's that. And then depending on which package you buy, there's also a brand new lunchbox that goes with the program as well. Um, because it is important to take food with you when you leave for the day. A lot of us are leaving, going to work, running errands, whatever it might be, and you need to be eating every couple of hours. That's part of how the program works. So having the ability to take it with you in a convenient way. Um, I helped, I worked with the team to help design the lunchbox. It also comes with some full-size containers that you can make meals in, but there's plenty of room to put your portion control containers in there as well. So home program, you're gonna get all the videos, the workbook, the log book, the new cookbook, 75 healthy lunch ideas for kids, and depending on the package, you can also get the lunchbox. So that's the home program. Now I wanna move on to talking about the certification. And as excited as I am about the home program, I'm like 10 times more excited for you guys about the certification, okay? So here's, here's what I wanna say about the certification. Over the last five years, I can't tell you guys how many coaches have come up to me and said, you know, 21 Day Fix has changed my business. It's the program I put every new challenger on first. You know, it's simple workouts and the modifier and they're 30 minutes and the container system is included. And so they learn the containers and they have success and they stick around and it's been amazing, which I absolutely love here. Okay, so ultimate portion fix certification is to a new coach what 21 day fix is to a new challenger. Let me just say that for you again. The ultimate portion fix certification is going to be to a new coach, what 21 day fix is to a new challenger. Every single coach that you bring into the business, the first thing you should have them do, the first program you should have them do is get certified to be an ultimate portion fix master coach. I don't say this you guys because it's my program. I say it because it's the, the container system goes with every fitness program we have. People use it. They love it. It becomes a way of life and it truly helps them. And it's, it's not just for new coaches. The certification is for all coaches. The reason I say for new coaches especially is because there's a lot to the coaching business. I know. I watch. I see all the things that you guys have to figure out and do and learn. And um, for a new coach coming in, for some they're going to like grab it and grab the bull by the horns and they're just going to like dive in and go for it. But for other people, it can be really overwhelming and they get a little bit stuck. Like, what do I do? What do I do first? How do I talk to people? How do I invite through social media? How do I run a challenge group? And these are all things we're going to talk about in the certification. So the way the certification works is you don't have to buy the home program and the certification at the same time but you do have to buy the home program before you can buy the certification. You cannot just purchase certification. And that is because I designed them to go hand in hand, which means when you're going through it, you watch home program video one, and then you watch cert video one. You watch home program video two, cert video two. And I did this for a very specific reason. I want you, the coach, to still see and hear and learn 
what your challengers are seeing, learning, and hearing, which means you watch the home program video, then you come over to the cert video, and then it's me talking to you, the coach, saying, okay, this is what you just heard me say in the home program. Here's what your challengers are going to learn. Here's what they're going to ask you. Here's the questions that are going to come up. Here's where they're going to get stumped. Here's where they're going to need extra help. And here's how you help them. So you have to hear what they're going to hear in order to understand how to help them. Because if they watch that home program video and come to you with a question and you haven't watched it or heard what I've said, it'll be harder for you to coach them through it. So you're going to watch home, pro pro home program video, cert program video. I've also given you guys in the certification several extra worksheets for, your, for you to be able to use with your challengers. And these are downloadable PDFs. They're not in a printed workbook, like they're not like this, they're not in, um, in the printed guidebook. And I did that for a reason also. Yes, you can use these worksheets, but really they're meant for you to give to your challengers as you see fit for those who need help, okay? I wanted you, the coach, to have extra tools to be able to help them. So then being in PDF form allows you to download them and then just upload them to your challenge group or email them off to somebody. And what I mean by that, by like giving them extra support. So if somebody is struggling to come up with their deep why or what they wanna change in their life, there's the Clarity and Actions Worksheet. It's 22 questions designed for them to take a deeper look inside at themselves about to get clarity about where are they at in their journey right now what um what changes do they need to make what do they need more of what are they willing to sacrifice what are they not willing to sacrifice where do they need to set some boundaries in their life and then you go into the action questions about okay what actions are they going to take what are they going to change what what activities can they start doing to bring more fitness into their life? All these things. And so by filling that questionnaire out, it's going to help them go deeper into where they're at so that they can figure out where they're going. So there's, there's several other worksheets like that that you guys will get as well. So you're going to get all the certification videos. You're going to get the worksheets. And then there's two more components that I think are going to be really crucial to a lot of people. Uh, again, any new coach, but even coaches that have been doing this for a while. So there is the social media guide. So this is a guide I designed for you guys to show you how to take the information that you're learning and then turn it into a social media post to invite people to your group. So if we're watching video five all about food addiction, how do you take what you're learning in the food addiction video and turn it into an Instagram story to make an invite out of it? And I literally have created an entire Instagram story and walk you through each slide about, okay, why, why this slide? What's the underlying message of this slide? You know, here's the problem. Here's the solution. Here's the call to action at the end. And then here's how you follow, follow up on that call to action. It's going to be really important for a lot of people. While we like to think everybody is social media savvy because so many people are on social media all the time, not everybody is. I ran a group last summer called Obsessed with Coaching, where after we finished the original round of 80 Day Obsession, I took almost 11,000 coaches through 80 Day Obsession, but I did it in a way of showing them how to use 80 Day Obsession to grow their business. And while I had a lot of um, vet veteran coaches in that group, there was a ton of new coaches. And I cannot tell you guys how many of those new coaches were so overwhelmed by social media. They didn't know where to start. They didn't know how to do it. They didn't know or feel comfortable giving the call to action or following up on the call to action. So this social media guide is designed for that, to show you how to take this information that you're learning and turn it into social media posts and invites to hopefully get more people into your group. Okay, I think that's gonna be really, really beneficial. And then the last component of the certification is the um, the challenge group guide. So the home program has a challenge group guide. It always does. But that challenge group guide is written by the business leaders at Beachbody, which is great and it's fantastic. The certification challenge group guide was written by me. I've run a few challenge groups over the last few years, helped a couple hundred thousand people through them. So I've learned a thing or two. I also talked to a lot of the top coaches that have amazingly successful groups. And I took all that information and I put it in this challenge guide. And it's it, everything, everything from what a challenge group is, um, 
to where to run a challenge group, be it on Facebook or my challenge tracker app or both places to how to invite, how do you invite three weeks out? How do you invite two weeks out? How do you invite one week out? And then 30 sample posts of running an ultimate portion fix challenge group, like literally day by day, here's what you could post or, or you can take this and turn it into your own version of that. And I did it for a reason. You guys, I've done this program for five years. I have gotten all the questions. I know exactly what people are going to ask pretty much on what day. I know in week one, they're gonna be going through detox symptoms if this is a new way of eating. So I give you posts that allow you to talk about that comfortably. I know in week two, if people lost a bunch of weight in week one, come week two, they're gonna get on the scale, they're gonna panic because they're not gonna lose as much weight and they're gonna start questioning what they're doing wrong. And they're not doing anything wrong. So I'm giving you posts that allow you to talk about that and bring that to the surface. I know we want people using the fixate recipes. Um, so I give you posts that, that encourage them to use it and post their food photos and things like that. So you can use the guide as much as you want. You might be really great at challenge groups. You might not need it, but maybe you wake up one day and you're just stuck for an idea for a post. You can come into the challenge group guide and be like, what did Autumn say to post about on day 12? Great, use it, post it, it's there for you. That's the whole point of it. So there is the, the challenge group guide that you're gonna be able to use to get you through this as well. So with the CERT, you're getting all of the videos that go side by side with the home program. You're getting all the extra worksheets that allow you to have more tools to help your challengers. You're getting the social media guide and you're getting the challenge group guide, okay? That is certification. Then there is the master series. And I know not everybody is totally familiar with what the master series is. The master series is ongoing education. It's continuity, okay? So master series is $19.99 a month in addition to the one-time purchase of your certification, okay? And the way master series works is every single month, we're updating it with new content. All the content that we put up every month will stay there, but new content will get added every month as well. And we have several different categories that we're populating every month. So there's the business category. Under that, um, it'll I'll be doing videos, talking to you more about how to use Ultimate Portion Fix to grow your business. Carl will be doing videos. I'm sure Michael Neiman will be doing videos, or Kim or Kevin. Um, once, once the program launches and coaches are doing really well, we will reach out to them and I will interview some of them about the success they're having and how they're doing it. So that's the business category. There's also the social media category. So where every month I'll be giving you new sample posts of how to invite to your challenge group. Um, if a new platform becomes available, we'll talk to you and give you ideas on how to use that new platform with Ultimate Portion Fix to invite people in. If there's new algorithms that are changing the way that you should be posting, we'll be sharing that with you. So there'll be a lot that happens within the social media um, category as well. Every month, five new fixate recipes will get added to master series, and they will be exclusive to master series for three months before they move over to fixate on Beach Body on Demand. And that's how that'll get populated for the next year. Any new recipe that we do will go to master series first, and then three months later, we'll move over to fixate on Beach Body on Demand. So if you want access to all those new recipes every month, you need to be on master series. You can use them for yourself. You can share them with your challengers, all that, but that's where they will be. There will also be a challenge group guide every month. There are so many different ways you can use Ultimate Portion Fix. There's so many uh, niche markets that you can use it with, right? You can run an Ultimate Portion Fix group for pregnant women. You can run one for breastfeeding women. You can run one for people doing a fitness program like Morning Meltdown coming up this summer when um, when that launches. Uh, you're gonna wanna know how to how to use Ultimate Portion Fix with that challenge group. Um, maybe you want to do a holiday one. So every single month, I'll be picking a theme and I'll be writing 30 new posts, basically, to go with that theme. So that if you choose to use that, that theme to run a challenge group, you again have an idea of what to talk about, how to talk about it, and that sort of thing. I do want to point out, I'm saying 30 days. So Ultimate Portion Fix, it's a way of life, but we're tracking in 30-day increments. 
And I do that just so you have a day one and then, okay, at day 30 is when I reweigh myself, is when we recalculate if we've lost weight, it's when we do measurements, that sort of thing. Um, so I guess in a way it's a 30 day program, but really it's a lifelong program where you're just checking in every 30 days for progress and that sort of thing. Okay, also in master series, um, Every month, I will be interviewing different experts uh, in, in a variety of categories, everything from, um, from um, personal development to nutrition to maybe exercise science. We've got a big list of people that we're working on. We just haven't finished completely locking in dates for everybody yet, so I'm not going to say who they are, but there will be some pretty awesome people that will get interviewed, so you'll want to tune in for that as well. So Master Series will be the business category, social media category, challenge group category, new fix rate recipes, experts, oh, live Q&As with me every month, um, again, based around a specific topic. I'll be taking like five, 10 questions and answering those questions so that, um, so that you guys have all this information that you get to keep learning every month, you get to keep growing. You will get continuing education credits when you do the certification. And I should point out that um, you'll go through all your materials, you'll take your test, you need to pass your test with an 80% or better. Um, you can take the test as many times as you need to to pass. Once you do, you have the title of Ultimate Portion Fix Master Coach. With Master Series, here's how it works. If you stay on Master Series for 12 consecutive months, you'll get leveled up, which means, you know, you do the certification, you have title Ultimate Portion Fix Master Coach. Stay on Master Series for 12 months, your, uh, your ultimate portion fix master coach level one. Stay on for 24 months, ultimate portion fix master coach level two, and so on. And every 12 months, you'll get sent an e-badge that you can either post on your website or post on social media. And it's your way of letting your challengers know, hey, I take my business seriously. I'm always continuing my education, which means I'm able to help you that much more. Um, so that's how master series works. Really quickly, I just want to take a few minutes and talk about the upcoming filming of 21 Day Fix and Fix Extreme. Super excited about that. So we're getting ready to refilm both of those programs live and in real time. The only way you can participate in the live filming is to buy Ultimate Portion Fix in the month of March. So you're going to want to do that. Ultimate Portion Fix goes on sale to coaches March 4th. It goes on sale to the general public March 18th. The filming of 21 Day Fix um, starts April 1st. It'll be in the nine o'clock hour. We haven't completely settled on the time yet, probably 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, but I'm not totally positive yet. The beauty of refilming this is, yes, the workouts will still be 30 minutes. Yes, there will still be a modifier. And yes, they will be based off of the original workouts. But much like I did with 80 Day Obsession, where I could change things a little bit each week to keep you making progress, to keep you off that fitness plateau, I get to do that now with Fix and Fix Extreme. It will be a little bit different than 80 Day Obsession. With 80 Day Obsession, I was changing the rep pattern and the amount of weight that you were using. With 21 Day Fix, I'm actually changing the workout move just a little bit each week to make it a little bit more intense. Not a lot, just a little. And it also is going to allow me to bridge the gap between the two programs. I actually think 21 Day Fix Extreme is probably the hardest program I've ever put out. And I think that there's a little bit of a gap between the intensity of fix and fix extreme. So by dialing 21 day fix up a little bit each week, and then actually in week one of fix extreme, I'm dialing it back just a little bit. That allows me to bridge the gap so that when somebody goes from fix over to fix extreme, they're not like, oh my gosh, what just happened to me? Um, so again, 21 Day Fix starts filming April 1st. We film April, April 1st through the 21st. We take one week off and then we come back April 29th and we film through May 19th for Fix Extreme. There will be two different challenge or two different uh, coach test groups that I'm going to run. There is the Ultimate Portion Fix Master Coach Certification Group. That group, I believe, starts March 18th, and it'll be a two-week-long group. Did this for a very specific reason. Anybody that's really serious about being a master coach and getting this certification and taking their business to the next level, I want to be there helping you, coaching you through that certification and answering any questions that you might have before we ever go live to um, the filming of 21 Day Fix. So we'll go through that certification over a two-week period so that you're learning it, 
you're inviting to your group as you go through the certification because you literally start inviting to your group on day one of the certification so that your group is built and ready to go by the time you complete it. And then come April 1st, when we start the filming, you're already a certified Ultimate Portion Fix Master Coach. So I have that group going on. And then there will be the other group that I have, which will be Ultimate Portion Fix Home Program plus filming of 21 Day Fix slash Fix Extreme. And I'll have both of those groups going on. And yes, you have to be a coach to get in them. And yes, you have to purchase Ultimate Portion Fix to get in them as well. So we just covered a whole lot. I think that is it, Kevin, if you want to take it back over. Oh my gosh. March 4th cannot come fast enough. That's that's the feeling I'm getting. I'm watching the comments, Autumn, as people, as you're talking, and people are like, just take my money now, Autumn, take it. Because they find, they, they get it. I think you a excellent job of explaining, look, you think you know these? You don't know these at all. You don't know these at all. Like this is the confidence that comes with this certification and with the home program will level up the coaches to a place where they they can confidently approach people and say, look, I can help you because I've gone through this. I know how to respond to your questions. I've been where you've been. This is phenomenal. So coaches, what you need to do now, first of all, make sure your entire team watches this video. Tag them, share it, do whatever. This training is going to get so many views because there's so much value in it. Tag your team, share it with them. And as soon as they're done, commit them to commit them to getting the whole program or the master series or the certification, excuse me. Get commitments. Have a March 4th list of all your coaches that are going to purchase on March 4th so they can go through the program and so they can watch the video so that come March 18th, you have a separate list of your customers who are going to purchase this as well. Take advantage of this momentum. Autumn at NLC, Michael mentioned how, how committed Autumn is to you succeeding, and you've, she's proven it here again today. Autumn, thank you so much for taking time. This has been extremely beneficial. Coaches, take action. This has been phenomenal. Thank you so much. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.